Hello children, good morning all of you. Today for class 8, discount, exercise 7.3 from ML Agarwal's book. Please pay your attention on the board. Sum number 3, a notebook is marked as rupees 30. Find the price a student pays a dozen notebooks if he gets 15% discount. Before solving this sum, you have to remember this. This is the vital. Please pay your full attention. Discount is given on the marked price only. Discount you have to calculate on marked price only. Marked price also named as list price or PP. Printed price. You have to remember PP. SP equal to MP minus discount and discount equal to mark price minus SP. Discount percent denoted by D percent. Discount by MP into 100 percent. SP equal to MP minus discount of MP or LP or PP. LP that is list price, PP that is Printed price. Successive discount that is D1 percent, D2 percent, D3 percent in this way. Then SP equal to 1 minus D1 by 100 into 1 minus D2 by 100 in this way of MP. You have to remember this. Now pay attention on the solution of the sum. Here a notebook is marked rupees 30. MP of one dozen notebook that is rupees 30 into 12 that is rupees 360. He gets discount equal to 15%. Therefore, discount equal to 15 by 100 into rupees 360. By calculation, it is coming 54. Now we have to find out if the students pays how much. Therefore, the students pays the price 360. That is the mark price. And this is discount that we have to subtract from mark price and by that we are getting rupees 306. 306 is the answer. Next sum. A list price of an article is rupees 800 and a dealer is selling it at a discount of 20%. There are two parts. First, the selling price of the article and second the cost price of the article. Now pay your attention on the solution. The list price that is the MP mark price of an article equal to rupees 800 given and discount 20%. SP equal to mark price minus discount by 100 into MP by, cal by putting the values and by calculation we are getting SP rupees 640. That is required SP. First part is completed. Second part. Now he makes 25% profit on the selling it. Let the CP of the article be rupees X. Therefore, SP equal to CP plus 25 by 100 into CP. That is CP we have considered X. X and by calculation it is coming x by 4 by simplifying we are getting value of x equal to 512 steps are given clearly if you follow attentively then easily you will understand therefore the cp of the article is rupees 512 this is the answer if you feel difficulties then what will you do you have to observe again if you follow attentively again and again then everything will be clear understand okay thank you everybody